Hi, I'm Abby, and I'm reading Stargirl, and I'm going to do some inferences and um, with evidence. So my inference is Stargirl has just, which is like she's like a, like the weirdo kind of, but she, like she's doing lots of weird things that aren't normal. And someone named Hillary Kimball had a birthday the next day, like after like Halloween or so. Oh yeah. And um, Stargirl always sings to them, but Hillary didn't want. Stargirl to sing to her, so she asked her, like, meanly, like, can you not sing to me? So, so Stargirl listens to that, and doesn't sing to Hillary Kimball. But, but, so, like, everyone's being so quiet, because they want to hear everything. They're scared that he, even if they take a, like, a crunch out of, like, a, like, they take a bite out of a potato chip, they're going to miss something. Because when you take a bite out of a potato chip, it crunches. So you don't want to, they don't want to miss anything, because it's supposed to be, like, a really big moment since Hillary isn't, probably isn't really the nicest person. And Stargirl wants to probably make friends. And and Hillary has her own little group of girls, and I would probably want to join that group of girls, so Stargirl might try and do that. And um, so Stargirl doesn't sing to Hillary, but goes over to Leo and looks at him and sings Happy Birthday, but does Hillary's name. She doesn't sing to Hillary. She sings, like, she does tap. She does sings happy birthday. So she's happy birthday to you. Um, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Hillary. But she's doing it to Leo. So she's not doing it to. But then Hillary gets so mad. She's probably like, all my fame is going to Leo now, and she didn't obey me. Like I asked her nicely. Um, and so. And Stargo says that, um, and Leo asks, why did you do that? And Stargo says, I don't know, you're just a little, like, cute, and pulls on his yellow, which is, like, this little part, uh, maybe this part, you know, like, because you're, like, but, but, like, it's a girl talking to a boy, and he's just saying he's cute. So, my inference is that maybe Stargo has a crush on Leo. Because I think Kevin does already, and maybe if she if she will be interviewed by Kevin, Leo will probably be there, and she'll probably do it because Leo is there. So I think she just and maybe because Leo must be like really nice to her or something, and that's really nice. So she's just trying to make friends, and if she's with Leo, like if she likes Leo, then it's actually pretty nice because then she. Like she, like she's kind of making friends because she know when you know she's probably not gonna be, she's probably not gonna be friends with um Hillary. So it says um. So after she finished singing Happy Birthday, the students burst from their silence with a wild applause. Hillary Kimball stomped from the lunchroom. Kevin looked up at Stargo and pointed at me and asked what, 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 and, and said what everyone must have been thinking. Why him? Stargo tilted her head as if studying me. She grinned. Mr. Stoy. She tugged on my earlobe and said, he's cute, and walked up. I was feeling nine, nine ways at once, and then, and they all ended up at the touch of um, of her on my ear until Kevin reached over and dinked the same ear. This this keeps getting more and more interesting, he said. I think it's time to see Archie. Which I don't see Archie. I don't know what that is. But it must be like something in um, like the school. So that's my inference and prediction for Stargirl. Bye!